to, turning back to the technical challenge, so that if you look into kind of like why wouldn't this work? We have cooling issues here on planet Earth, right? That's the whole back to the whole energy driver and liquid cooling and the impact on the environment. Yeah, yeah. So the way that a terrestrial data center keeps cold is you either blast air past the chips or you um you you're essentially evaporating off fresh water so you can have directed chip liquid cooling and then that fresh water goes out to a cycle a cooling tower, which is mostly most often is just uh, evaporating fresh water. So you don't have air or fresh water in space. Um, and so you need a, a new way of doing that. So you don't have convection or conduction, essentially. And the way that you do that is um, you need a large surface area that essentially glows in infrared. Everything in the world is glowing in infrared. Like if you had a, a heat camera on your face right now, you'd see that your face is your face is glowing in infrared. Yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> um, and so and that, what that, that, that just means is you're just emitting energy in, uh, in a... Yeah, in infrared, basically, it's a deep space. So, yeah, that's the that, that's what we do. We need to keep a large surface at a certain temperature, and then that will uh, emit that infrared. 